what is going on everyone welcome back to the channel lab of bonsai so i have this juniper here that looks pretty yellow and i have seen this question a lot where you know people who are starting bonsai they see their their juniper looking this way and they want to know what's going on what they can do to save it or if it's still even alive or savable so i'll show you some of the things that you can check for and see and what you can do to try to save it so the first thing is, you want to make sure that the tree is outdoor. Junipers or conifers, they need full sunlight. If you have it inside, that's the main reason why your tree is yellowing and dying. When you see the brown tips like this, that's a really bad sign. Junipers start losing their color on the foliage first, and it slowly takes away the whole tree. This one right here might still have a chance, what you can look for is underneath all that yellowing. Sometimes you might see some more green coming out. So one tip that I would suggest is removing all the dead um, branches or foliage. Leave it outside if it's inside and make sure that it's getting full sunlight. At least six hours of full sunlight. It doesn't matter if it's winter. This tree needs to go outside. They can survive. You know pretty pretty harsh conditions sometimes so make sure that you leave it outside the next thing you want to do is the scratch test so what it does is you want to make a little scratch with your nail or with a tool and you want to make sure that it's still green as you can see this one right here it's got some dark green inside this is a really good sign but if you see that is yellow or faded green or pretty much brown there's nothing that you can do. Your tree is pretty much dead or already dying. Nothing you can do to save it. But if you see green under that bark, then there's a lot that you can do. So make sure that you get plenty of sunlight. You got well-draining soil. That's a really important thing, well-draining soil. So what do you wanna check? You wanna check that the soil is not too wet or too dry. What I do sometimes you, you want to stick your finger maybe like two inches inside of the soil and see if it's still moist or wet. If it is, don't water. Leave it alone. If it's kind of dry or pretty much dry, you need to water that tree. Only water if it's needed. If you water too much, it's going to get root rot. And once you start getting that root rot, you're going to start seeing that yellowing at the tips. So really important, do not overwater. Only when it's needed, you want to water. So here's an example of a healthy looking juniper. Under the sun, nice deep green, only water when it's needed. This is how a juniper should look. As you can see where the shadow is, deep green. That's how your juniper should be looking. So quick recap, scratch the bark, make sure that the tree is still savable make sure that you're not overwatering, underwatering. Also, make sure that it's getting plenty of sunlight, not through a window, but outside, completely outdoors. These trees need full sunlight. Hopefully you are able to save your tree. Again, I'm sorry to say this, but if you scratch the bark and it's faded green, brown, or pretty much white, there's nothing that you can do. Start over with a new tree, Make sure that you follow some tips and research more about the species that you're getting to make sure that you're able to provide the best environment. Good luck with your tree. Thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe, share, and you have a great day.